Hello there, Shirley Rocks here. Welcome to a new video. This is We Are The Dwarves. Now, I got uh, sent a promo um, copy of this. This is from a developer called Whale Rock. And this is an awesome game. It's built as a sort of cross between a strategy, action, adventure, tactical fantasy style of game. All of those genres. And you will see when we start playing. So, I'm going to start a new game. And we're going to dive right into it. I'm not going to watch too much of the intro. Well, I'm not going to watch any of the intro. Just so we can get into the game and concentrate on the gameplay. Now, um, I've not played an awful lot of this. So, this is more of a blind playthrough. I've only done a few levels of it. So... I decided to do a full playthrough of it and show the game off and maybe, you know, convince you guys to get it as well because it is awesome. It's loads of fun. Super hard. Let me let me think how to describe it. Uh, really nice looking, super hard and brilliant fun. So here we go. Let's do play. Let's see. We have just landed. We have crashed. And he starts off, and you've not got a lot of, um... There's only you and your own at the moment. You don't start off with full health, you're a bit knackered. Uh, left mouse button makes you move, right cancels. So, let's see, there you go. So, move, cancel, move, cancel. These are like exploration points here. You go along and click on these. Now, what enemy... That's basically explaining that enemies can find you via four different methods. They can visual, see you, they can, um... They can touch um, if you're, you know. Ah, actually, I, I read that wrong. Uh, touch helps helps spot the enemy in the vicinity, even if he sneaks behind or hides in the hideout. So that must be. I must have a special touch ability, which I won't go around uh, bragging to too many people. Uh, they can also um, they can hear stuff. So if you're moving through the the growth of the shrubbery they'll hear you and they will become alert and come and investigate and kill you uh, and some apparently can smell you because you know basically what dwar dwarves must smell so right so first of all hold down alt that shows you the way they're looking so i've got to kill this patrol first so let's go ahead kill you can kill them by knocking them off okay that was uh too bad Right now, first of all, I know this is, I, I know this bit. All I know is the big rock gives you, gives you health. So let's get me health back. Okay. Now, I've died on so many times on this bit in the game that you would not believe. Okay. So if you look at this one here, he's looking over here. So you need to sort of try and wiggle around a little bit. Okay. Now. The tricky part now is this. Uh oh, I'm going to slow down time by pressing space. You can still perform actions. So we're going to move over here. And we want to try and get them both in a shot. So, too far away from the edge to actually... They're too far away from the edge to actually, um, you know, go over the edge. So we're just going to blatantly run up on them. We should be able to get quite close to them before they turn around and suspect us. He's got the ear symbol, so I mean, I think that means he's he he's heard me. He's heard me. Is that even English? So we're going to take a shot at them. Let's see what damage we do. Okay, not very good damage. And now we're going to run away because you do tend to fly back quite a bit. Okay, let's get this next shot lined up ready. There you go. Okay. As you can see, this one here isn't giving up. Oh, and would you see? And there's me thinking this is going to be flawless, and I've just died and killed myself. Right, let's do it. Let's try it again. The the, the general thing that that then seen that seemed to work. Right, let's try again. So. Yeah, he seems to be able to take about half the health off, so I don't think that shotgun blast one is good enough to actually kill them. Let's throw it near the edge like that. So, let's get our health back again. Touch the stone. Touch the lucky stone! That's what she said. 
Right, now, I can't, basically I can't go that way because he's going to see me. I'm thinking... Let's, 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 I'm curious about something. I want to see what the, I want to see what the recall's like on this one. I mean, he's looking that way and he's looking that way. I could. I'm going to try something. This might be a little bit crazy. I'm going to try and get over to the side of him. This probably won't work. I'll try and get over to the side of him and use the shot ability and shoot him over that way. Might not work. Okay. Well, he's, he's seen me, so... Screw it. Let's go for it. Let's shoot him. Um, mm, it's probably a bad idea. This. Let's uh, let's run away. Okay. All right. We're slowly turning around. Run away again. Wow. He d he doesn't give up. Let's try and just engage him. To cancel, cancel, cancel. Right. Engage him now. Well, that's sort of one way of doing it. That's not really, wasn't really the best, the best way of doing it. Let's go back and see if we can, can we use this stone twice. Oh, we can. Nice. Let's get to the next area. Whew. So that's how to do it. I don't, I don't know if it's an easy way of doing it. If you find an easy way of doing it, Feel free to leave a message below. Okay, next area. Ooh. So, resources. Valuable minerals can be used to repair and improve space, space suits. Energy ore, star crest, dwarf and stone. So, there's, an, there's one here. Okay, so we've got some research resources here. New article, consumables. So, let's press J. I'm going to skip all this. This is just your journal, basically. So, gemology consumables. What does the blue thing do? Energy ore. Powerful source of energy. Okay, so it's basically repairs your armor and use, it's used to recharge spacesuit subsystems. Ooh. Now. Okay. Oh, dear. These are all coming to investigate. Um, we're going to be in trouble here, aren't we? They're going to they're going to see me. So let's try and shoot him off the edge. Okay. Followed by another shot. Hit him. There you go. That's how you do it. That's not really how you do it, but. Another usable part here. Okay, runestone. Used to save game, repair, and improve spacesuits. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, there's another resource over here. I see you. There we go. I don't think there's any more resources. There's another one over there, isn't there? Can we go over here? Any enemies over here? Ooh, there's some enemies. Let's let's pause. Where are they going? So he's up there. Now. He's gonna come down here. Hopefully he's not gonna see me though. There's two of them up here, so. Oh, and I've been spotted. Sneaking ever. Okay, so that's a that's touch the lucky stone and get our health back. Oh, that was terrible. Okay, so we've got more of these resourcey things here. 
think I saw another one down here somewhere. Um, is there another one? No, I can't see them all. Let's go. Let's go to the rune stone and. Uh, oh, there's one. Nice. Any more hidden ones? None that I can spy. So let's go and use this. Okay, repair the spacesuit. Here we go. Try and save. Game saved. Characters. Layers of the spacesuit armor increase protection of the owner. When an armor layer is completely broken, its armor bonus disappears. Ooh. Repair damaged armor. Double click on it. Energy ore is required. Okay. Tr the Tree of Perks. Tree of Perks. Perks are activated with a dwarf and stones. You need for each dwarf. Okay, so... I guess... And I, I've got one of these yellowy type ones. So I'm guessing that means I can activate one in this one. Um, there's 200 to repair it. How many points have I got there? Hmm. Oh, I've got 200 energy ore and I've got one star crust. So how do I do some of these cool, awesome things then? Do, do I need... I can basically, I can unlock that one there, Torsionic Fields. What does that do there? I think I've just used it. Oh, there's no confirmation. That sucks. At least you can zoom around and see the, uh, <laughs> the dwarf to me looks like he's got, um... What? Flashlight. Have I got a flashlight on by default? It looks like there's other stuff as well. I can activate life support. Uh, defib. Ooh, this is nice. Right, do you want safe changes? Yes. Right, we need to go to the next area now. I assume it's, it's over here, the next area. Through here. Oh, hang on, repair at least two. Oh, okay. Okay then, Dad, sorry. So I'm assuming that's the armor level there, so let's. Good characters. There we go. There we go. S. Ooh. That piece appeared then. I wasn't there before. Ooh. Anyone alive there? Repeat. Anyone alive there? Okay. Next level. Or next bit. It's time to move on now. So hopefully I'm going to get another another dude. I don't know if it's going to control by AI or will I have to control them both and switch between the two. Whoa, there's another dwarf. Okay, what's he doing? This is second speaking. Anyone alive there? Woo! We're not alone. He looks relieved. By Odin's beard, I'm not alone. I'm on some completely messed up planet, though. What on earth is that? Smash fist. We barely survived an emergency ejection. Our ship got in some. Oh, cool. So that's our um, that's our ship then. Okay, so now I'm going to switch to this guy now. Oh, cool. Right, so that was our first one was Smash Fist. No, no, it was in four. So this is Smash Fist. So I'm going to leave the, this video here. This is going to be the, the part for part two. I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed watching this. Uh, don't forget, this is We Are The Dwarves. And this has just come out, and it's pretty freaking awesome. So stay tuned for part two. Don't forget to leave a sub and a like if you enjoy watching this, and I'll make sure I uh, upload the rest of the series from start to finish.